Hi, Miss Jones. My name is Patty. I'm your CNA today. How are you? Great. I need to clean your catheter. Is that okay? Let me close your curtain for privacy. I'm going to go wash my hands, get my supplies. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm going to get a barrier and place it on my table so I have a clean area to put my supplies. I need four washcloths for this skill. I need a towel. I need a chucks. And I need a privacy blanket. I need a basin and soap. Let me get some water in the basin. I'll be right back. Ms. Jones, would you like to check the water temperature and make sure it's okay? It's good. Wonderful. Just let me grab a pair of gloves and I'll be right with you. Okay, I'm going to spread this privacy blanket out over you. This is going to help provide privacy and keep you warm while we complete the skill. All right, Ms. Jones, if you can hold that blanket in place, I'm going to pull this sheet down to about your knees. Be careful not to grab that tubing as I do that. I'm going to place the chucks under you. This will help keep the bed dry while we clean you up. And I'll get a pair of gloves. Now in just a moment I'm going to ask you to scoot toward me. We're going to roll you up on your left side and I'm going to place this barrier under you, okay? If you can scoot towards me please. And roll up on your left side. One, Make sure I don't grab that tubing. One, two, three. And we'll roll this out. Tuck it up underneath your hip. Ms. Jones, come on back. Okay, if you can scoot toward me, I'm going to roll you up on your right side. One, two, three. And I'm going to smooth that chucks out. Come on back. Thank you. Okay, now we're ready to get started. I'm going to put my washcloths in the basin. Move this over here. All right, Ms. Jones, I'm going to pull the blanket up. This is going to expose you. I'm going to make this as brief as possible. Please let me know if you're uncomfortable. Okay, I'm going to lay this over your legs. I'm going to get a washcloth, wring it out really well, and I'm going to soak four corners. I'm going to make sure that I hold this catheter where it is inserted into your body, and we're going to clean the tubing. One, Wrap the washcloth around and come away from the body. Two. We're going to hold the catheter to make sure it doesn't pull. Three. And four. Let's set that aside. Wring that out really well. And now we're going to rinse those same areas. Hold the tubing. One. Fold it over. Two. Fold it over three, and the last one, four. Set that aside. I'm going to use a corner of the towel, and we're going to dry the same way. Now that the tubing is clean, I have to clean the area around the tubing, Mrs. Jones. So I'm going to wring the washcloth out, 
and I'm going to sew five corners. Three, four, and the back side of the fourth one is the fifth. All right, Miss Jones, I'm going to hold you open for just a moment and clean down the center. I'm going to pull the catheter out of the way, hold you open, and clean once right down the center. Fold that over. We're going to clean the outside down one side, the outside down the other side, fold it over, skin fold, and skin fold. Set that aside. Almost done. One final rinse. Okay, we're going to repeat the process. I'm going to hold the catheter up out of the way. I'm going to open you up and go once right down the middle. Outside. The outside. Skin fold. And skin fold. Set that aside. I'm going to take a corner of the towel and draw you off from top to bottom. Once I reach bottom, we'll come out. I want to make sure that your tubing isn't kinked or on the floor where I can trip on it. And it looks good. All right, let me get you covered back up. Ms. Jones, can you scoot towards me? I'm going to remove that pad out from under you. Go ahead and lift up if you would. I'm going to roll that and tuck it under your hip. Go ahead and come on back. If I can get you to scoot toward me again, please. Roll up on your right side. And I'm going to remove that pad. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to put these in dirty linen and clean my basin. I'll be right back. Set it down and spray it with disinfectant spray. Paper towel to pick it up. Paper towel to dry the inside. Throw that away. Paper towel to dry the outside. Throw that away. And one for the drawer. Okay, Ms. Jones, I'm going to pick up your soap. I'm going to put your basin back in your drawer. These items will get thrown away, and I'm going to go remove my gloves. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm going to remove that blanket from you. I'm going to touch the underside and fold it over. And pull your sheet up. Again, make sure that catheter is not kinked or touching the floor. Here's your call light if you should need anything. I'm going to put these in dirty linen. Okay, I'm going to open up your curtain. Is there anything else I can get for you while I'm here? No? Okay, I'm going to wash my hands. I'll be right back. I'll review all the steps to my skill, make any corrections as necessary. My skill is complete. Need scrubs for your new career? Visit foryouruniforms.com and enter the code CNA video for a special discount. Need additional resources? For your CNA has what you need. With practice tests, an online workbook, instructional videos, practice kits and supplies, and our very own skills book with step-by-step -step instructions, you will feel confident when you take the CNA exam. Visit foryourcna.com today. Continuing education for CNAs are called in-services. In-services are now offered online at foryourcna.com.